hi guys welcome back to a new vlog today is saturday i just finished taking a shower right now i have my hair in this messy cornrows um i've had these cornrows for about i want to say two two weeks or maybe three weeks even a long time um, i just want to take it out now because i want to wear my hair in an afro for the last time also my hair is extremely dirty but that's intentional because i'm going to go to the salon tomorrow and do something about this hair to study now 9 30 now i can't believe one hour has passed since i started this vlog i really love my hair this big but maintenance is an issue Hi guys, I'm just coming out of a short break right now and during my break I was watching an episode of um, the Dave Ramsey show. Well, not an episode, they have these short clips on YouTube where they break it down into like 5 minute clips, 10 minute clips. I was watching one. Yo! If there's anything that I'm grateful to Africa about is the fact that we don't have this so-called credit system. Like, you either live within your means or you find a way to amplify your means. That's the only way. You cannot borrow. You're borrowing from who? Ah. Where are my socks? I actually just watched this episode with a guy who is currently $80,000 in debt. Why is education so expensive in the US? It's too expensive. Honestly, I value education now, but not that much. This is too much money to spend on any type of degree. I don't care what you're studying. Except you're going to be a doctor or a lawyer in the US. Only in the US. If you're going to work in those fields out of the US, then never mind. I'm starting to feel sleepy. Let's get to work. Alright my loves, I'm going to bed. <laughs> this is my version of protecting my hair before I go to sleep, so please pay no mind. Let's see what's the time now. It's 1.30, it's 1.30 p.m. Um, sorry, a.m. Good night. Hi guys, I'm walking to church now. Oh my gosh, I am late, but better late than never. I woke up a bit late, but... It's all good, it's all good.
check the mic and make sure it sound right, boys. Hi guys, I just got back home. So after church, I had a stroll with a friend. We had some coffee. We had a very wonderful conversation. One of the things that I want to share with you is we talked a bit about discipline and motivation. And you know, those are two things that I've been struggling with over the past year. I think we've all actually been struggling with that on some level. But one point that he really made is we should have the right motivation behind doing the things that we do. If you have the right motivations, then everything else is going to fall into place a bit easier. Even though everything might not be apparent to you up front, your path will reveal itself at every step of the way. And as Christians, he pointed out that our motivations are supposed to be founded in God. And that even trickles down to the way we pray. The things that we pray for, we have to step back and ask ourselves, why do we need this particular thing that we are praying for? Why do we want it? What do we want to do with it? How does it contribute to our purpose here on earth? How does it contribute to the kingdom of God as a whole? These are just things that he was saying over coffee and I was like, yes! I mean, on a daily basis, we pray for an elevated status, for things to be better, for this, for that. Not necessarily even material things. Eh? When God gives you whatever it is that you're asking for, are you going to use it to help other people? Are you going to use it to teach other people? Are you going to use it to glorify God's name? You then tend to glorify yourself or to, to feel superior to everybody else. So these are all things that I personally need to reflect on. I just felt like sharing, you know, that little nugget with you. I think I can start with the rest of my day. I went to the place where I was supposed to do my hair and it was locked. I didn't know that they closed on Sundays. Yeah. At least that will give me one more day to be very indecisive about what I actually want to do with my hair. I was thinking of relaxing it, but when I undid the cornrows yesterday and I looked at, you know, the gloriousness in the mirror, I was like, why do I want to re relax my hair? Why? But in two days, when the shrinkage shows up, I'll go back to wanting to relax my hair. Somebody told me that you're not actually supposed to comb afros. I'm just cleaning my bag. Is that true or nah? I mean, I don't like combing my hair, but at the same time, I don't like when it when it knocks up and just shrinks into nothingness. <sighs> I actually can't do anything until I make my bed. I did up a little bit and um, let me check my pockets. Yeah, I want to go put a load of laundry and then I'm going to start studying. Should I change my sheets? Nah, my sheets don't need to. My sheets don't need to be changed. my first break oh the joints the joints are killing me <laughs> mm. i stopped studying at 355 to take a five to ten minute break and i ended up taking a 20 minute break 
I'm not hungry. 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 Stop thinking about food. p.m. now. I'm going to fry some sweet potatoes. I'm about to eat eggs, chicken, onions, tomatoes, all fried together, and my sweet potatoes. Mm. Anyway, that brings us to the end of this vlog. To be honest, I'm only ending this vlog because I've run out of space on my memory card, so I have to say bye. So um, I hope you enjoyed this video. Please, if you did, leave a thumbs up. Drop any comments that you have below and of course if you're new and you haven't subscribed to this channel please do so it helps this channel out and um i'll see you in the next video